Hi, buddy. My name is Dude. Welcome back to Lie Eat. Lie, lie Eat. We're gonna eat lies and be adorable and stuff. But first, I'm gonna poke you. I'm gonna poke you. I flicked his forehead. Can I? Oh, okay. Third time's not the charm for this particular scenario. Okay. Um. Let's go. I'm kind of curious what's down this dark alley at night. That'd be kind of. Oh, nothing. Okay. I thought something interesting would be here since it's a dark alley at night. Maybe some criminal of some kind was going to try to kidnap a little girl and then be sorely disappointed when I beat the shit out of them. Oh, I'll talk to you. Hey, Effie! Where's the white haired guy? Asleep. Oh, that's early. Hey, Effie, do you still remember when you were born? Yeah, um. I thought things were bright, then I saw Leo. And his eyes got all white. And then I got a bath towel. Something tells me you were naked this second got born as we all are and he was shocked and didn't want to see that because that's perverted and he threw a towel at your face well do you know why you eat lies I, I don't know hmm. that's nice very interesting he's quite the liar so you're never short of food are you when someone lies I can smell it out but I can't eat it until I know for sure it's a lie if I eat a truth it tastes gross but Leo doesn't smell of lies and I can't tell what's a truth or a lie it sucks. He even keeps his truth to a minimum. Hmm. Real enigma he is. So you can't eat clever lies. And if someone knows it's a lie, or if the liar themselves... Yeah, I'm real mysterious too. Hey, about those heart fruits? What are those? Oh, you mean these love berries. The yellow ones are sweet, but the red one a little sour. Also, they're pretty soft, so they go splat if you throw them at people. Get them all sticky. Ugh. Myself, I throw them into the eyes of my foes to daze them. Aren't they food? Ah, uh, so many mysteries. I've been developing real interest in you, Effie. Bad touch? Easy, I won't do anything. Oh, good. Alright, there's still a little something you need to check. Look at the time. You should get back, too. Didn't that guy tell you not to go out at night? But the wolf thing? Can't be that scary. I've beat up bears before. Bears? Bar! Why are you talking bars? Why are you talking to bar? I'm not gonna burn. I just want to go yet. I'm going back just for. I can take a bear. I can take a bear. No problem. I got. I got it. I got a fucking bear. Come on. Bring it. Bring it, bitch. Bring the fucking bear on. Come on. Say goodnight. Head straight home now. Here. See you tomorrow. I'm gonna find a bear outside, aren't I? Got dark, huh? I should go straight back. And I got a bad feeling. I should go straight back. I don't want to go straight back. Hi. Your bed's on the other side, idiot. But I want to sleep with you. It's dark out and scary outside. I want to save really quick and, like, go outside for a second. I am curious. I am curious of what thing might hold outside. And there's nothing to worry about. Because I'm a little girl who can punch the shit out of things. Ooh. Somebody's there. You're... <sighs> bad. Oh. I did choose poorly. Well, I'm glad I saved. Well, I'm really glad I saved. Yeah, let's sleep. Let's, let's sleep. What? Hey, that scream just... That's a scream? Let's check it out. Stay right behind me. Don't wander off. Okay. Um, I'm gonna save again. <laughs> okay, there we go. Well, we know where something is. Let's go to this dark alleyway. What's a- oh. Wait, what? What is that? What is that? What is that? Oh my god, it's our informant. No good, she's gone. Really? Really. Hey, she's wounded on the neck. Yeah, you're right. Looks like bite marks. Well, what to do here? I'll have to tell the winged informant, I suppose. What are we gonna do? We'll give them a call, as much as I hate to see them. It's their job to deal with this kind of thing, after all. Dead. Yeah, dead. I, I kind of figured. I was hoping to fight a thing when I went down here with Effie. So this is our, this is who died? Yep, this is who died. 
Love berries. I can't take them? She doesn't need them anymore. I guess that's kind of rude, though. Hello? You two seen anything suspicious? So I see. Another one. You seen anything suspicious? Someone died. Probably murder. Huh? There's the informant in the hat. Lend me your phone so I can call you know who. I'll make the call. We'll be here tomorrow morning at the earliest. Go to go to your place, lock the door, and stay inside. Glad you understand. Won't be asking for any money, right? You're so rude! I just don't want to lend you anything important to my work. I wouldn't stand for it if you sneakily made off with the personal info on this phone. You trust me that little? What are we going to do about her? Just going to have to leave her until they arrive. Yes. If she was indeed murdered, we wouldn't want to make any missteps in the crime scene. Yes? You're leaving her like that? Can't do much else. We're no experts. Ex -per Still, though. It's hard to believe the Hatter was done in. Wasn't she rather strong? She could also go down quick if somebody got behind her. Oh, would she? Is that what happened when you first met? That's dirty! Okay. Still not enough info. We'll gather more tomorrow. Oh, and just at a glance, it looks like there were bite marks on the neck. So you think this town's vampire story? Still think it's up in the air as to whether it's true. How puzzling. Let's think it over carefully tomorrow. Good idea. See you. Bye. Okay. I only know two people that could be vampires. Can you get to sleep? I don't know. If you really can't fall asleep, you can sleep over here. <laughs> as if you're actually that dejected. Good night. Good night. We did lock the door, right? The performance with the hap just stopped moving. I'd only just been talking with her. Will I ever get to sleep tonight? I might not. Ow! Ah! Finally, we're leaving. Get ready. I'm sleepy. I've got more than where that came from. I'm up! Morning! 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 At least give me coffee before you slap my face. That'd be nice. What? Huh? Long time no see. Yeah, to be expected, though. You're always around when these things happen. The child? Hey, let me be clear, this is not my kid. Captain, I'm all done with... Eh? Yo. You again? I suppose you're the culprit in this case. I don't suppose you're the culprit in this case. And that child there, isn't she a dragon? First fraud, now kidnapping? Where does this end with you? Dragon? She hatched from an egg. The egg just suddenly appeared under my bed. And hey, just try and prove that fraud incident. You're not calling me a crook without evidence, are you? Calm down a bit, brat. But as you wish. Indeed, she does seem to be a dragon. Fellow dragons know each other just like that, huh? He's a dragon? Right, forgive me. Hello there, miss. I am Neil Massafield, captain of the police. This is Vice Captain Brett. Cool. Uh, ni nice to meet you. Um, there's... Have you found anything about the murder? Yeah, introduction's cool. It's all business of Nintendo, so excuse us for now. We intend to stay until the culprit is caught, comes to us for anything. Unless I indicate otherwise, it is our duty to protect even these two. Thank you. So long, then. So those guys are dragons, too. First time you've met them, huh? Well, I guess I've been avoiding them as much as I can. But when it comes to dragons, they know their stuff. Time for me to gather info. You can go play, I guess. You know the drill. Don't wander off too far. I'll go see her first. Um... Doubt's the cat lady. I only know one other her. And it's... Well, not you. You're a he. You're a she. How about you? Nope. You won't talk to me. Fuck. Seems someone was attacked, even after my insisting they refrain from going out at night. It seems so. Anything in here? Nope. I guess we'll go in there at some point later on. So if that's the case, then there's only one other person I can talk to, unless it's on the, uh, investigation team. So you... Morning, Mr. Swinton. I'm Leo here. Any new info? Right, I'll tell you what happened. I gathered yesterday. So what did you get? This is an old story. There's a family of vampires who lived in a certain town. They are very gentle souls, yet they came. Yet there came to be many cases of missing townspeople. But then one day, those who had gone missing were found in that family's mansion, drained of their blood. Was that this town? No, this happened elsewhere. Afterward, the family was executed for being horrifying vampires. 
That's kind of racist. I mean, they were cool and all. Why would you kill them upright? That, that's that's rude. You don't do that. It seems one of the family was able to quietly escape from the town, and they came here and married an ordinary human. With each generation, the vampire blood gradually weakened, but one day, decades later, another townsperson was attacked. What then? That's all I learned. You couldn't find any records of anything after that. The pages were ripped out. Ah, that's right. It was written in a book. A diary, perhaps? Name of Geo Rigfire. Rigfire. Same as what I found. In short, the ones who would know the most should be those siblings. Yeah. I was thinking, my payment? I already knew all that stuff. What? You could have told me that first. Here. What's this? A tea cookie. I could have told you that. I'm asking you why you're showing me this. Does an informant like you really not know about these cookies? Huh. I believe they'd, there'd be anyone who doesn't. I know, of course, about these cookies. From Milk Tea Town? Yes. One only one baked every two months? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Know all about these cookies. Believe me, yes. You must know the value of them, right? <laughs> a cookie, really? A, a cookie. Thank you for the information. Would you like a cookie? <laughs> wow, Leo. Wow, Leo. You just pulled that on... On an informant. Wow. Okay. I'm gonna save and question these people. Oh. Oh, I only have... Oh, never mind. Let's go this way. Go here. Seems someone's attacking my insisting to go out. I'd like to ask you some things about that. Oh? Who are you to... I said I was a traveler, but the truth is... This makes you a detective. Yeah, sorry I had to hide it. Alright, I'll do whatever I can to assist. Thank you. What were you doing the night of last night? I was reading a book, and then I nodded off. After that, I woke... I was awoken by a person's scream, then I locked the front door. Since it would be dangerous if the wolf came inside. I see. Nothing. Are you familiar with the legend of the vampires in this town? Well, not so much. I did hear from my father that there was such a legend. It was long ago, and that family has long since perished, yes? Is that right? Thank you for your time. No, it was nothing. Goodbye. This guy's a terrible liar, but for now, fine. Next, his sister. Should I have Effie with me? To tell whether or not this is a lie. Oh, mind if we have her? No. No! I see. Oh! She learned! Yay! Okay. I need Effie. Kids are tough to deal with. Incidentally, the design for the detective badge got changed last year, didn't it? They changed it a lot. I wish I knew how to make those replicas myself. I guess I go ask him some things, too. Him. Him. You, right? No, not you. Um... Somebody. A her? A him? A he? Where's the he? Is there a command post set up anywhere that I could, like, talk to you? Before I end this episode? Anything? Library? Library? Nope. Nothing. Hello? Hello? Is there a command post set up where I can speak to you, or do I need to talk to the cat man? I think your mistress should be able to maybe be re-educated about star- Huh. I think your mistress should maybe be re-educated starting with the basics. I must admit on numerous occasions that the mistress is a bit slow on the uptake. But as such, I do get to see some amusing things. As long as I get my due pay, I have no real qualms. Well, that's not the he. That's not the he I was expecting. Where, oh where, in the fuck, is this guy's command post? Or would he be at the uh, crime scene? Uh, now that I think about it, yeah, crime scene. What do you want? Found anything out? Been here investigating, I hope. Yeah. What, would he, what else would he be doing? Um, so for yourself, the victim, Carol Deleda, was stabbed with a knife. There are multiple stab wounds, but not such... Not much bleeding, it seems. Not much blood at all, in fact. There's a lot of blood on that. On the... Yeah, what? So no, what's the sticky stuff on the wall? It looks like blood, but it's gonna kind of... Oh. It's a little sour, I guess. Probably Loveberry. You licked it. That was the fastest way. Damn. 
Do you just lick a rant? Mm. No, 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 not. Even if it were poison, I would. Don't forget it. What about the wolf? Wolf, huh? We've only looked a little, but we haven't found one yet. In fact, I don't sense any animals around here at all. Bugs, maybe, but that's it. I see, thanks. I'll make a note of that. Red. Cool. It's. It's love berry juice and not. Oh. Sorry. Maybe we should fish around for a little more info. I bet Effie will bring in something herself. Will she? Found her. Found another. More people, more lies. So weird. And I got more cookies. Let's beat this one up. Oh. Oh, we're just gonna go right into a fight then. Alright. Tasty. Not very big though. What now? Maybe I'll read a book. Yeah, okay, I gotta, I gotta practice my reading. There's another lie. But I'm gonna save first. Oh, I can't actually save over that, because it's the hard part. Whatever. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe for more. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And thank you to TKR Intro for supporting me on Patreon this month. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye Okay. What the fuck hit me? here. Can I fly? What the hell is- my head is in my asshole. It's not, not, it's not, I did not get, I don't get paid enough for this job. Honestly, if I had this kind of line of work, I would be